You know, a lot of these wagons were commercially built, but once they found their home on the ranch and they needed to be converted to a chuck wagon, it was oftentimes done by the local cow hands, whatever degree of expertise they had or didn't. Most of them were used to punching cows, not sawing lumber. So let's try to try to figure out how would they have done this? Did they know what a rabbit was? Did they know what a dado was? Probably a rabbit was in the stew and a dado was a dodo. Let's see if we could do something close to how maybe they did it. Well, the first thing we're gonna do with this normal grain farm wagon is put some bows on it and a covered top here eventually, but this first section is how I set up bows. Pretty simple, pretty straightforward. You know, on the back of this wagon, there's gonna be the kitchen box or the chuck box that holds all the cooking supplies. And underneath there's another box called the pan box or the pan boot that was where the cast iron and the pots and pans would be carried. Well, that's a pretty simple, straightforward box. It does have some dados and some rabbits, but it's not fancy carpentry work. This is something pretty simple that a local ranch hand could have done.
Well, I do need to figure out the hardware to make a little latch for this back tailgate on this pan boot. We'll do this here this next week and see what we can kind of get figured out. Anyways, hope you find it interesting. Once again, thanks for watching.